Hey everybody, my name is Dick Polipnik, and I am collaborating here with Phil Polipnik on Hourglass Productions. In today's episode, we are going to be talking about the different kinds of tripods that you can use in your filming when you're making your short films. So this is my tripod. This is just a $15 one you can get from Walmart. It is a Targus uh, TG5060TR. That's a lot of acronyms and letters and numbers for something that's just 15 bucks. And pretty much is a you know extends. It's got little uh, extenders like this. You know you take it like that. It loosens it. You know you can go like this. Blah 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 blah. Lock it into place. Um, you can go like that. You can tighten this thing. You can extend the top. Uh, and this is the handle pretty much. And you can use it to like do panoramic. You know follow someone in motion. You can actually it has a little level here. I don't know if you can see that a bubble level. A good way to tell if you about the quality of a tripod is based on the number of if you levels. hit it on a rock 15 times how damaged it is well, well that would decrease the value but it would show you how durable it is right well wouldn't that i could just like carve a tripod out of stone wouldn't that mean that it's a great tripod yeah anyway so this is your pretty average beginner one and i think wouldn't you agree that Instead of just going straight for the fifteen dollar one, unless you're doing like a one day filming thing for like a class or something, or for you know for your teacher. If you're doing consistent filming, you want to go for something on the higher end. Look at this beauty. Oh, it's smooth. Can I, can I smell it, Phil? Nice. It smells oh, nice. Yeah. And this it even. What? You mean you don't have to adjust the height by hand, Phil? I mean, technically, it's still by hand. Well, but I got a little lever to put, do most of the work for me. Wow, because, I mean, because this is definitely too much work. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I know, ain't it? You want to know how much I paid for this, Phil? I'm going to guess since I paid $15 for mine, you got to pay $1,500 for that. Well, you see, Dick, I paid about as much for this is you paid for your education. Absolutely nothing! <laughs>